everyone this is Rochelle and today I just wanted to bring a little video to you um, I've still been getting questions about the weight loss um, and how I've been keeping it off and all the good stuff and you know it's like a couple of months after New Year's and you know how it is we set our goals we're gonna do A, B, C, and D and here it is February and you're already selling your membership on Craigslist or eBay so your gym membership so we're gonna talk about it today just some things that I don't know some things that I have learned and realized with this whole new way of eating might even call it a diet weight loss regimen just a whole way of being more healthy um just want to talk to you a little bit about it i'm gonna tell you guys <clears throat> i'm not eating bird food okay i am not eating salads every day i'm not snacking on celery every day i'm eating food regular food just like you I'm just making better choices. That's all I'm doing. I told you guys in the other weight loss video. I'll link it below if you're interested in it. Um, I'm just eating better. Eating better. I'm going to tell, tell you a few things I've been doing um, and, and things I've noticed in this new way of eating, new way of living. I don't know. That I've noticed that um, yield huge, huge benefits. Okay? Huge benefits. I mean, you feel it. I always always except for broccoli always had canned foods canned foods always had it just whatever canned foods get just can of corn can of peas mix it up butter can of you know green beans can of beans whatever you don't put okay i no longer eat anything canned anything canned anything packaged well now i'm still working on the package so i'm gonna work on the meats but i'll talk about that later um vegetables let's just talk about the vegetables okay Get out a can of vegetables. I know you got a can in your in your cabinet. Look at it. Look at the sodium in it. I'm thinking vegetables in a can are good because it's just vegetables and juice. No, there are, there are so many things of nastiness. I know that wasn't right, but it just rolled with it. So many things of nastiness in these cans of veggies that we have been consuming. There's so much freaking salt. And you know, when you put your vegetables in a pot and cook, you know you're going to add some salt and pepper to it. You, should, you wouldn't believe how much salt is already in there. Preserve it. It's just crap when you look at it. Look at the color of it. This stuff don't look like that. Just stuff they didn't put in there, you guys. I don't eat, like I said, I don't eat anything canned. I just realized this maybe a few months ago. Nothing canned. Nothing can. Look at it, you guys. I encourage you to just turn this shit around and look at the label. Once you start eating better, you are going to feel so much better. You are just going to, you're going to be able to taste the food, okay? So I was like, I looked at it one day. I think my cousin put me on. I don't know. She was saying something about she don't eat canned food. I'm like, what the hell are you tripping? And anyway, I looked, because I just assumed. And I looked, and I was like, I be tagged. So anyway, look at the can. Look at what you're eating. Stop eating the canned foods. Give it a go a little bit more expensive. It's not like organic or anything like that. I mean, if you can do that, it's probably good, but I, I'm not there yet. Get frozen veggies. Get frozen veggies. Oh my gosh. You will taste them. And they don't, I'm telling you, they taste nothing like the stuff in the can. It was like I thought something was wrong with the frozen food. Yeah, because it tastes so much different from the canned food. But once I started eating it and realizing it, and it was just like, Wait a minute, this tastes good. This is better than... I don't even put salt and pepper on my vegetables anymore. I mean, rarely. Very rarely. Rarely I put butter on there. Rarely. Because I can taste the food. I'm not looking to taste salt and say, I didn't need some salt. I'm looking to taste the damn food I'm eating. I want to taste the green bean. I want to know what that tastes like. And it's so different from the canned stuff. It has a crunch to it. You know, it has some color to it. You can taste it up in your cheeks. You can taste the stuff. Corn, the little melons. I was telling you about the melons before, but they do have a little bit of seasoning in it, but it's not a whole bunch of sodium. But you guys, look at what you're eating. That's all I can say. Oh, look at what you're eating, okay? I'm going to tell you something else that I, this is just a quick little thing. This ain't really a how-to. It's just a little update. Um, Something, things I've learned, okay? Um, Hot dogs. Oh, you love hot dogs. I used to love hot dogs too. I thought I was doing good with trying to get like the turkey hot dogs or whatever. If I taste a hot dog right now, I probably, I'm going to say that. It wouldn't sit well. Okay? It wouldn't sit well. Okay? 
I don't know whether it's because I'm used to just eat all like just whole foods now, but when I taste the processed stuff that I used to eat, it is really freaking nasty. It don't it doesn't taste like food. I mean it's not saying for me to cook out that I won't go burn on the grill. I mean that's something else. But you know, just you know, hot dogs having for the kids, you know, for snack, whatever. No more hot dogs in the house. No more. I'm tell you what happened. I'll tell you what happened. They had a special on the Nathan hot dogs at the grocery store. You know those some good hot dogs, Nathan's. So I think it was like two for six or something like that. You know, they like six dollars a piece for a pack. So I just bungled up and got two packs. I was like, this is the good stuff. I'll get this. Y'all taste them hot dogs. Oh my gosh, it was just rubbish. You know what it, it I know I know it's not this bad. But it was not dissimilar from eating Vienna sausages. And not saying anything against Nathan's or anything like that. They got good, I mean, come on, you know they got good hot dogs. I'm just saying, after you have been eating right, it is, eating right. After you've been eating right, you go try to taste some stuff now, you realize it's like, it's just all salt and crap. Crap, okay? Same with lunch meats. I don't know how I'm gonna figure that one out because I still eat lunch meat. You know, I'll get turkey now and I'll just check the sodium and sugar and all that kind of stuff. But I don't gotta figure that out. I ain't gonna be baking no damn turkey and uh, I don't know. We'll figure that one out. But same with all that, same with chips, same thing. I like pretzels. I like whole grain stuff now. I like, I'll eat the tortilla chips, but potato chips? And I like potato chips, but potato chips? They just feel so greasy, as I'm telling you. I'm not trying to act like I'm all holier than thou. I'm just trying to tell you that I'm eating better. I'm eating right, and it's better for me, and I know it's going to be better for you. I know it. I'm telling you, you're still doing no exercise. You see I, the weight I've lost. I ain't doing I mean, I'm not going to say I ain't doing them. I mean, occasionally I'll do some, but it's not like I have a regimen for exercise. I haven't done anything. I'm just eating better. Just eating better, you guys. You can do it. You can do it. Same with the juices and everything. Leave the juices alone. Look at the sugar in that juice. Look at the sugar in that juice. I don't like juice now. Only juice I can drink, really, you guys, is apple juice. No, not apple juice. Um, orange juice. And a little bit of that. Orange juice. Or if I have more apple juice or something like that, I'll have to water it down a little bit. Just so, you know, it's just too much in there. It works, you guys. I just want to reinforce, because I know some of y'all have fallen off. Just try to switch a few things, a few things at a time, and then you will see the weight fall off. You will see your skin will look better. You're fitting. I got on makeup, but you know, you'll just, you'll see it. You'll feel better. Just give it a go. Just try it. If you could try it just for a week or so, for a week or so, substitute water for everything you drink. Water. Just water. It's water. You're supposed to drink it. Water. Watch. Watch what your body is going to feel like, what your face is going to look like at the end of the week. Try it. Just try it. Water for a week. Maybe I should make contest. Water for a week. Water for a week and just see. It ain't that bad. It ain't that bad. You put some lemon juice in there if you want to. A couple drops and some Splenda stirred up or whatever. Nativa. Is it Nativa? I don't know. Some other kind of sugar. Somebody was telling me about it. It's saying Splenda won't that great. I don't know. I still use it. I have to do the research. Um, but yeah, whatever it's sweetening you like. Just not sweet, though. Not equal. Not sugar. If, you, if that's what you need to do, um, try it. I'm telling you guys, it's a winner. What else can I tell you to do? Oh, your bread. Your bread. Switch from the, I already told you about it in another video, I'm going to reinforce the white bread. I know it's delicious. I know. Stop with the white bread. The process. Get you some nature's own whole wheat bread. Try that for a week. It's not so bad. It's not so bad. It ain't so bad. It's good. Okay, you're going to feel so much better about what you're doing for your body, what you're doing for your health, what you're doing for your family. Give it a go, you guys. Okay, just try it and see. Try it for me. You can do it for you, what you should do it for you. Try it for me. Just do it. I mean, you guys, you just I just want to share it with you because um, y'all can do it. If you are interested in dropping a couple pounds or if you're interested, not even about the pounds, but just having a healthier um, diet, you can do it. I know the last time I had some salad. Or, mm-mm, mm-mm, just better choices. That's all. Still have my little hamburgers. My hamburger, not cheeseburger. I still have my hamburgers. I'll get fries occasionally. I have ice cream cone occasionally. You know, it ain't like once a month. 
once a week maybe I mean I I still eat you guys but just healthier you can do it just a little pep talk um I know not much comedy in this one but you know just a little pep talk for you you can do it let me know if you need some um uh recipes or anything I mean just <sighs> basics you can do it read the label you don't need no daggone recipe read the label that's all count the calories you'll be fine just a tip for you sodium um i didn't say it's in other video sodium okay you shouldn't be consuming more than 20 between 2300 and 2200 and 2300 grams of sodium i believe is what it is or milligrams or something milligram i think it's milligrams milligrams of sodium a day so just to give you an idea of what you're supposed to be you know eating when you're eating the amounts of sodium so check the sodium because that's ridiculous and a lot of the diet foods too. try to stick with the whole foods try to get you some water some whole grains you can do it leave the cheese alone I know I know I you know how much I love cheese you have no idea how much I love cheese occasionally I have some cheese it's just not that big a damn difference though it's not I mean if you got nachos that's something else I mean something to require that's something else okay I'm gonna get your cheese but I'm saying, you know, regular food, throwing cheese on this, cheese on that, bacon bits on. Just eat the daggone food and taste what the food tastes like. It ain't so bad. It's another thing about the food, too. You know, food, it's, it can be like a drug. It really can be. It can be like, I mean, I, I don't know. And I am Christian, okay, so I don't mean to offend anyone, but this is, you know, my channel. And this is what I believe. This is just how I am, okay? So, I'm sorry. I ain't sorry. So, okay. Um, God made food to be food. To eat, nourish, replenish. That's what food is. No, I don't read the Bible that much. So, I, I you know, don't quote me. I'm just saying I, the basics. I know the basics, okay? Leave me alone. Okay, so it's not supposed to be, oh, my God, I got to have that cheese. It's not supposed to be like that. It's just food. Well, it tastes good, but it ain't supposed to be the end all be all. That casserole you bought to bake. It's food for your body. That's all it is, a tool. And I think we've I think we've just become consumed with just over accessorizing our food. It's just food. Eat it. And then go on with your regular life. The important stuff. Okay? And not the food. Food's a basic. You got other stuff you need to be doing than sitting around salivating over this cheeseburger, piece of cake, steak, whatever else it is. Okay? It's food. My mouth is watering right now. That's so bad. <laughs> it's food, you guys. It's food. I think we put too much in the food. We just gotten lost in flavors and all this other stuff. But it's just food for your body. It's just gas for the lawnmower. That's all. It's just gas for the car. That's all it is. Everything else is the fun stuff. Love is the fun stuff. Life is the fun stuff. Learning is the fun stuff. You know? So I don't know. Just keep that in mind. It ain't that serious. It's just food. It's just food. Okay. It's just food. So that's all I want to say. Just want to bring it to you real quick. I don't know how long I was. I got a whole new way of recording, so I can't even see the time. So sorry if it, was, it ran a little long. I just wanted to give this to you. Um, hopefully it may have helped someone or put somebody else on the right track. I know it helped one person. Get you right on the right track. I hope it did. Um, you know, I'm not saying everybody got to be a size 2. I ain't no size 2. Hopefully. Or anything like that. I just want you to be healthy. I want you to stick around. I want you to feel good. And uh, I don't want you to look good in your clothes. You know how we do. You know how we are when we look good in the clothes. You know. So um, that's all this is for. I just want to just um, supplement. So um, yeah, have a great day. Um, have a good week. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.